Uh, we will oppose the scheme this evening for a number of reasons. It won't work. Uh, it will cost a fortune, £290 million already, without a single person having gone, and it's against our values. That does not mean that we don't recognise the challenge that there is with people crossing in small boats across the Channel. We have to stop that. We have a duty to stop that. But stopping that means not gimmicks, but rolling our sleeves up with a practical plan that will actually work. For but me, I, I don't think it'll work. I think it's very expensive and it's the wrong thing to do. Uh, it's also looking at the problem at the wrong end. Because the question is, um, how are you going to deal with the trade in people across the world? I would just say one other thing, Peter, because there's been a lot of discussion today about COP28. Um, if we're serious about dealing with this issue, this problem, we've got to recognise that we've got a responsibility to do something about the things that are driving people across borders in the first place. One of the biggest drivers is and is increasingly going to be climate change. We have an obligation to ensure that we do everything we can, leading on the world stage, to meet our obligations, not just to save our planet, but to save millions of people from journeys they might not otherwise make.